Behold the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. Blessed are those invited to communion with him. Lord, I am not worthy to receive you, but only say the word and I shall be healed. For those of you at home, join me in this prayer for grace. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. I once was lost, but now am found, was blind, but now I see. Twas grace that taught my heart to fear, and grace my fears relieved. How precious did that grace appear, the hour I first believed. Through many dangers, toils, and snares, I have already come. Tis grace has brought me safe thus far, and grace will lead me home. Amen. Let us pray. All-powerful God, you renew us with your sacraments. Help us to thank you by lives of faithful service. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. We've heard the word. We've listened to the story of Jesus. We've heard about a prophet Micah. And now let's live maybe through our own actions to show the God of compassion for the poor, the God of understanding for the weak and the lowly and the sick. The Lord be with you. Also May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Mass has ended. Let us go from it in the peace of Christ. Our thanks to an anonymous donor from North Bay, Ontario, whose generous contribution made the televising of today's Mass possible. On behalf of Father Bush, Father Coots, Father Fitzpatrick, Father Donovan, Father Lynch, and all of us here at Daily Mass, our best wishes for a restful weekend, and we'll be looking for you all again on Monday. <laughs>